into is our strength. Attitude is never given in. Attitude makes us who we are. One, two, three. Attitude. Attitude. Great job. Inside Villanova Basketball with Jay Wright is brought to you by your Quality Plus Four dealers, proud sponsors of Villanova Wildcats basketball, by the Villanova University Office of Conference Services, the main line to your next successful meeting or special program, by Plymouth Country Club, by Mainline Diagnostic Imaging, the Delaware Valley's leader in outpatient diagnostic imaging, by Pico, they put their energy into helping you save energy and money, and by UPS. We are Villanova University, passionate students, fearless innovators, future leaders. We are proud and grounded by humility. We learn together, work together, and celebrate together. We ignite change, making a difference together. Ignite change. Go Nova. Gunderman Group. Gunnerman Group is growing. Getting in a groove. Growth is gratifying. The goal is to grow. Gotta get greater growth. I just talked to UPS. They've got expert advice, special discounts, new technologies, like smart pickups. They'll only show up when you print a label, and it's automatic. We save time and money. Time? Money? Time and money. Awesome. 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 I love logistics. The design of the Ford Escape is clearly intended to grab your eye. Oh, and your foot. Huh, ain't that a kick. The Ford Escape with the foot-activated lift gate. Go open up something interesting. Go further. An energy-guzzling refrigerator can waste up to $150 a year. At Pico, we'll pick up your old fridge and pay you $50. Pico, we put our energy into helping you save energy and money. Hello, I'm Jay Wright, and welcome to another edition of Inside Villanova Basketball. There's so many great opportunities we get when players return but when one of your all-stars, NBA all-stars return, that's really cool. And Kyle Lowry came back recently, spent some time with us at the Davis Center, a good talk with myself, Darren Hilliard, some of the guys, met the guys when they came down to see him on the court at the Wells Fargo Center, and really a special experience for all of us at Villanova to have Kyle Lowry back in town. The bench at the Wells Fargo Center is almost like home for the Villanova Wildcats. But tonight's dress code is a little different for these players taking a busman's holiday. They're headed to their home away from home to visit with an old friend, a former Wildcat who's done more than just make it big. He's at the top of his game, and Kyle Lowry was back for one night in the place he still calls home, setting the bar for today's team and Wildcats in the future. I'm here all summer, so I see these guys all summer, and I, and I see how hard they work. And it's, it's, about, it's not about the things you say to them, it's about what I do. I'm here at 6 in the morning. I'm working out. I'm here. And for them guys to see a professional going into his ninth, tenth year, uh, working out 6 in the morning, putting the work in, lifting weights, you know, it's more about those type of things. And when you do say something to them, they listen. It speaks volumes because I'm, you know, they see me doing it. 
Lowry has emerged from a tough Philadelphia background on the way to becoming a consummate pro. Being a professional is big, you know, it's a, it's a part of every, every day of living, you know, no matter where you're going, you have to be a professional, always eyes on you, always somebody's watching you. And just being, you know, understanding that you have a job that uh, people have access to you and want to access you and you're in the public eye at all times. That spotlight burned brighter with his first trip to the NBA All-Star Game. And Kyle still gives a lot of credit for his rise to stardom to the foundation he laid at Villanova. Coach was big for my career in general. Not talking about basketball, but just in general as a man growing up. And, you know, he used to always say, just be a legit man. I kind of abide by it and, you know, every day you go by it and being a professional, you know, you have to always be a man of your word. And you know, when Coach texts me, it's usually, I love the charge, <laughs> love the deflection you got. You know, it's always those type of the little things, not scoring 40 points or 35 points. It's always the little small things, which, you know, he, he preaches here to win games. He's putting up the best numbers of his career, but still remembers his arrival at Villanova from Cardinal Doherty High School with an injury that looked like it might cost him his first year on the main line. It was one of the most frustrating times I've ever had in my life. Um, one of the most humbling times I've ever had in my life, but it was one of the, the best times I've had because it made me understand that basketball can be taken away from you any moment, and you have to take advantage of it. And you know, the, the game doesn't need you. The game would be fine without you. So you gotta just appreciate it, love it, and every time you step on the floor, play like it's your last time. The plan was to redshirt him, but Lowry was determined to get back on the floor. After a month of you know prehab with uh, Jeff, and I was like, look, let's just get the surgery done. And I got it done. And then, you know, something just happened. I remember one day I just like, yo, I feel good. And I, I, grabbed, I jumped up and grabbed the rim and I asked Coach Pickney. He was like, yo, man, what you doing, man? You got to get down from here. And uh, I felt good. And, you know, the, the coaches trusted in me. The trainers trusted that. Um, I could go out there and do it uh, and play basketball again. And so we said, look, forget the red shirt year. Let's go out here and do it. After a freshman season that landed him on the Big East All-Rookie Team, Lowry became a starter as a sophomore. He was named All-Big East Second Team, averaging 11 points, four rebounds, and nearly four assists per game. And his amazing talents were the perfect complement to Randy Foy, Alan Ray, and Mike Nardi as the Cats' four-guard offense won 28 games and were ranked as high as number three in the country on the way to the Elite Eight of the NCAA tournament. The relationships that I, I gained being here, the, the, the growth that I gained by being here, the experiences of winning while I was here because we took a program that was, you know, NIT, to a winning program. And I think the real memories you get is how you still back up a great program. You know, it was a, it was a great program with, you know, the 85 championship team. Had a little low period. Then you had Kerry, Alvin, you know, those guys. And then, you know, you had the little low period. You know, Gary Buchanan, you got those guys. Then you got a little low period. Then you get Randy, Allen, Nardi. Then you get myself, you know, that team. You know, then you get Scott. It's just one of the things that knowing that you help build up or build back a program that is such a elite and great program. Nova Nation sees that great tradition continuing with this year's team, and you can count Lowry as one of their biggest fans. I got Bleacher Report, so Villanova was one of my teams on my app. So <laughs> even if I'm not following it, I, I get my Bleacher Report. The last one I got was the the loss to Georgetown, but. Um, it's a long season. Right now, we're going through a little bit of a tough time ourselves, but it's a long season, so grind it out. You know, you can't worry about one loss. You just got to learn from the loss and build from it. In some ways, Kyle Lowry never really left home. When you first pick your colleges and you don't really understand that when you want to come home, you can be home. And, you know, this is home for me. Philadelphia, Illinois is home for me. So um, at the end of the day, you know, me going anywhere else would have been a pain because I probably wouldn't live there and I wouldn't have a place to work out or go back to and here I went here I have a great facility to come to great coaches you know to, to be able to let me go wherever I want to go and um, work around my time and I can work around their time easily because this is home and you know having a facility like this is the access is unbelievable you're planning your organization's next meeting or event consider the Villanova University Office of Conference Services 
You'll find state-of-the-art meeting facilities, award-winning dining services, modern guest apartments, professional one-stop planning assistance, and a convenient location right on the prestigious Villanova campus. Call us at 610-519-7580 or visit us at conferenceservices.villanova.edu. Villanova University Conference Services, the main line to your next successful meeting or special program. Today, a doctor sees an MRI of a traumatic sports injury, a mammogram of tiny tumors, a CT scan of blocked blood vessels. MDI is the Delaware Valley's leader in outpatient diagnostic imaging and we provide answers. From mammography with computer-aided detection to the most advanced open and high field MRI. Our board-certified radiologist and supportive staff provide unsurpassed patient-focused care. MDI, Delaware Valley's leader in outpatient diagnostic imaging. If you're a Delaware Valley golfer looking for the perfect place to call home, come take a look at Plymouth Country Club, located minutes west of Center City, Philadelphia, in beautiful Plymouth Meeting. This superior design will challenge your game and soothe your spirit. The clubhouse includes banquet facilities for up to 300, the perfect location for your wedding or special event. Plymouth Country Club offers a private club experience at a daily fee price, with membership starting at just $260 a month. Call or visit us on the web before this special offer disappears. We are Villanova University, passionate students, fearless innovators, future leaders. We are proud and grounded by humility. We learn together, work together, and celebrate together. We ignite change, making a difference together. Ignite change. Go Nova. He burst onto the scene, literally, as a freshman last season. Park down the lane, hanging in there, off the glass and good! Are you kidding me? Incredible athleticism by the freshman! He looked like he was running while he was up in the air. Sophomore Josh Hart is a running, jumping, and diving incarnation of one of the team's core values. It's easy to just go out there and just play Villanova basketball when you have, you know, 15 people behind you uh, that's going to be there with you at your highest point and at your lowest point. So having that confidence, that comfort that they gave me really helped me um, with this transition and, you know, kind of helped me surprise myself a little bit. I think with a lot of guys, when they come in, they have to find uh, a certain level of comfort in just knowledge of what we're doing, and that allows them to finally be aggressive and play hard. Josh is a guy that what he did in high school, defend, rebound, play his butt off, translated directly to our program right away. So we, we thought it was a perfect fit. Art learned to rev that inner engine from his parents. You know, they're always pushing me to, to be the best player I can be. Um, play hard no matter, no, matter what's, no matter what's going on. You know, if my shot's not falling, you know, play defense. Go after every ball. Even if the results of those chases brought some worries about his well-being. I think my mom probably wanted me to play a little bit like baseball or something. It's not, you know, as physical because she always say, you know, I'll hit the ground, I'll be, you know, the first, like hitting the ground 10, 15 times a game. And I know sometimes she's in the stands, she's just like holding the breath when I'm going, when I'm jumping in the air wildly or something. The good news is you can't take that desire out of Josh. It's a motivation that's a part of him, and he's willing to take his chances that all out is the only way for him to play basketball. If I fail, I'm gonna get back up. If I get hurt, you know, I'm a rehab. I'm gonna get back to what I was. You know, if you don't play hard, um, if, if you don't defend, you don't do, you know, those, those little things, um, you know, th this game will pass you by. Um, and that's something that I know for me, I don't, and I don't want that to happen. They push me um, every day. They don't want me to get complacent. They want, you know, 
to take me out of my comfort zone, no matter what it is, no matter if it's ball handling, shooting, defending. We're not worried about our own individual success. We're worried about the success of this team and the success of the person um, next to us. And I think that's really why this team is able to, you know, be, you know, what it can be and just run how it runs. The running part, no problem. Hart is still instant energy when he comes in as the first man off the bench. But now in his second year, he's working on refining his game, trying to be a more dangerous and well-rounded player. That starts with refining his jump shot. The playing hard stuff comes easy. The skill is something that he has spent countless hours working on, slowing him down, simplifying his mechanics, and just and simplifying his mind, you know, and, and, and how he's preparing for his shot, what he's thinking about when he comes into it. You know, I think a lot of guys can go in a gym and make a ton of shots by themselves, but th the challenge is teaching a guy to translate his shot into a game situation when there's a crowd, there's defense, the game's moving really fast. And um, for him, he's just, he just simplified his mind and simplified his mechanics, and it's really helped him. The improvement is something Nova Nation is getting to see on a game-by-game -game basis. Hart, open three left wing. He's got it, a swish for Hart. Every time I'm on the court, whether it's practice, whether it's a game, whether it's a workout, going in and doing what we do and just getting more comfortable with this system. And I think every day that I do that, that the coaches push me to do that, this game is going to slow down, you know, more and more and more. And, you know, that's something I'm really looking forward to. At the end of the day, I'm the only one that can look myself in the mirror and ask, you know, if I did everything I could do to help this team or, you know, to better myself. I think that's something that's really helped me, really motivated me um, to just go out there, you know, with no fear, you know, not fearing if I'm going to fail, not, you know, if I'm going to succeed, not fearing if I'm going to get hurt, you know, nothing like that. It's just, you know, going there with a clear mind and just, you know, help this team. It's difficult to come into a program like Villanova and have impact as a freshman. Josh Hart did that. It's even more difficult to come back the next year and build on that success. Josh Hart's doing that. He's a special kind of player. You've seen him improve as a shooter, as a defender, as a rebounder. He's got more to come. We look forward to seeing what Josh does in the next two years. We are Villanova University. Passionate students, fearless innovators, future leaders, we are proud and grounded by humility. We learn together, work together, and celebrate together. We ignite change, making a difference together. Ignite change. Go Nova. Amazing. <laughs> the rush of driving a Mustang oh. felt like never before. I could happily probably cry right now. It makes you feel like, wow, that is amazing. <laughs> Introducing the all new Ford Mustang. Experience more online now. Come on, man. Come on. An energy guzzling refrigerator can waste up to $150 a year. At Pico, we'll pick up your old fridge and pay you $50. Pico, we put our energy into helping you save energy and money. If you're planning your organization's next meeting or event, consider the Villanova University Office of Conference Services. You'll find state-of-the-art meeting facilities, award-winning dining services, modern guest apartments, professional one-stop planning assistance, and a convenient location right on the prestigious Villanova campus. Call us at 610-519-7580 or visit us at conferenceservices.villanova.edu. Villanova University Conference Services, the main line to your next successful meeting or special program. George 
touchdown, trailing. But remember, in their two previous meetings, Villanova led each time at the half, and the Hoyas came back to win it. Harold Jensen from the perimeter rattles in. But you know, you get the feeling everything Villanova throws up there seems to go in. When you look at the shots, it wasn't like it was all net. We're talking about some bounces that would rival any Penny Arcade. That field goal shooting percentage is unbelievable by Villanova. Everything went that way, our way. What I remember more than that is Harold Jensen just two, three months earlier sitting in the corner crying because he doesn't understand why he's not making shots and why things are not going right for him. I had to sit down with him and said, what you have is you have a group around you that don't care what happens, we just want you to do well. The run in the tournament helped me quite a bit. I was definitely at my peak of confidence for my, you know, for my college career of two years at that point. Coach Mass had confidence in me and that my teammates had confidence in me. Anytime you get a shot, shoot it. Coach had said, just go play. Don't be worried about making a shot. I'm not gonna pull you out. And I heard that repeatedly from him. And you know, after a point, you think, okay, maybe I gotta believe this guy. He knows what he's doing. Jensen puts Villanova ahead at the 235 mark. We're so happy for Harold Jensen. I mean, the guy worked so hard. Today, a doctor sees an MRI of a traumatic sports injury a mammogram of tiny tumors, a CT scan of blocked blood vessels. MDI is the Delaware Valley's leader in outpatient diagnostic imaging and we provide answers. From mammography with computer-aided detection to the most advanced open and high field MRI. Our board certified radiologists and supportive staff provide unsurpassed patient focused care. MDI, Delaware Valley's leader in outpatient diagnostic imaging. We are Villanova University, passionate students, fearless innovators, future leaders. We are proud and grounded by humility. We learn together, work together, and celebrate together. We ignite change, making a difference together. Ignite change, go Nova. Gunderman Group. Gunnerman Group is growing. Getting in a groove. Growth is gratifying. The goal is to grow. Gotta get greater growth. I just talked to UPS. They've got expert advice, special discounts, new technologies, like smart pickups. They'll only show up when you print a label, and it's automatic. We save time and money. Time? Money? Time and money. Awesome. 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 I love logistics. If you're planning your organization's next meeting or event, consider the Villanova University Office of Conference Services. You'll find state-of-the-art meeting facilities, award-winning dining services, modern guest apartments, professional one-stop planning assistance, and a convenient location right on the prestigious Villanova campus. Call us at 610-519-7580 or visit us at conferenceservices.villanova.edu. Villanova University Conference Services, the main line to your next successful meeting or special program. Brian Harrington was a member of our 1985 national championship team, a great Villanovan. And during his days on campus, he was impacted by the Augustinian community and the idea of giving back. And Brian became very successful. What he did with his time and with his money is he committed it to Each One Counts. It's a foundation that provides hospice care for children. Brian works hard at it. And he's got all of us inspired. He's got the students and the athletes at Villanova playing ping pong, paying money to give back to this foundation. Brian's had a great impact on Villanova's campus as a member of the national champions, and he's having a great impact on the world. Even on a Big East game night, the Pavilion and Nova Nations still have room for one more. Another game. Another chance to help people who need it. This time, it's ping pong to benefit a concept that was created by a member of the 1985 National Champions. Back in 81, 82, um, when Coach Massimino would take us to do community service projects and visit kids in hospitals. And it always touched me. 
um, that we as athletes could actually do something to brighten the lives of children that were less fortunate or people that were less fortunate. And as time passed, I had a career in the sports and entertainment business for a while and then in the world of philanthropy. And I hearkened and thought back to my days at Villanova and I said, how can I combine the two? And that was the birth of the Each One Counts Foundation. The foundation is making a big difference in the lives of children and their families. What we do is we raise funds to provide complementary pain management services, therapies, to children that are receiving pediatric hospice and palliative care. We provide massage therapy, pet therapy, yoga therapy, hydrotherapy, music therapy. All these different therapies are known to ease the pain and suffering of a child, yet insurance really doesn't cover the cost of them. So they're not readily available in hospitals for kids. You know, nobody really likes to talk about children that are dying. You know, there's no hope in that. However, there's still things that we can do to help them transition as they're passing. It is emotionally wrenching and it's trying at times, but then when I go and I see the therapies that when they're delivered and I see a little child that once was crying or you know, writhing in pain, that all of a sudden is quiet and still. And I look and I see their parents' faces, knowing that without these therapies, and without the, the raising funds for them, like the student-athletes here at Villanova are doing, they wouldn't get them. Villanova's student-athletes participated again this year in the University Table Tennis Program, where entry fees go directly to the children who need it most. They're touching lives for a long time, and they're, they're easing children's pain, so they should feel as gratified as I do. W without Villanova University's help and the administration's help, um, we could never do what we've done with the Each One Counts Foundation. It really was embraced, the concept was embraced, or without Coach Wright stepping up and saying, yeah, we'll help you, we'll do whatever we can to make this a reality because it's important. Um, it, it, it's Villanova community. When you get here day one, they preach about giving back and the importance of it, and it's real. It's not just a catchphrase or a tagline. You know, human touch is a very soothing thing. We need to give back whenever we can, wherever we can, whenever we can. What a great representative of Villanova University and Villanova basketball. Brian has an impact on a lot of people and hopefully all the students at Villanova, especially our players, have that idea that they can have an impact on the world and others when they leave. Well, that's going to do it for another edition of Inside Villanova Basketball. I'm Jay Wright. Go Cats! Inside Villanova Basketball with Jay Wright is brought to you by your Quality Plus Ford dealers, proud sponsors of Villanova Wildcats Basketball, by the Villanova University Office of Conference Services, the main line to your next successful meeting or special program, by Plymouth Country Club, by Mainline Diagnostic Imaging, the Delaware Valley's leader in outpatient diagnostic imaging, by Pico, they put their energy into helping you save energy and money. And by UPS.